This is where I'm gonna wear those gloves. Uh, I like these gloves because I hate when I wear gloves and I lose dexterity. So I still keep the dexterity here. Flathead screwdriver, you're gonna come over here. So I'm actually gonna get a smaller flathead. So this is a big flathead. I'm gonna get a smaller one. You're essentially gonna take out these two stops here on your rear bumper. So you'll have one here and one on the right side. So let me get a right size flathead. Okay, so just got this here, very small. Small little flathead. That'll go right in here. And we'll pop up this cap. That's it. So that pops out and we'll go pop out the other one. That's it. So once you have these caps off, you're gonna take that 10 mil socket and you're gonna go ahead and just remove this. So on both sides, this is gonna be one of the main bolts that are holding the bumper in. And just like that. Oh, can't hand do the rest. There we go. We're at the bottom of the bumper, and what you're gonna see now is one, two, three, four clips. This fourth clip looks a little bit damaged on mine, but all we're gonna do is replace or pop out the clips where it's being held from the bumper. So it's the furthest left and furthest right clip. So left and right, we're gonna go ahead and pop those out. So I actually have the bigger screwdriver here to go ahead and pop these clips. Um, mine seem to be really stubborn. Uh, yours might be too, so you might have to give these a little bit of a hard wiggle. All right, there we go. It took a, a bit of effort, but these are the clips here. You can see it's, it's older. Damaged it just a bit, but that's okay. Honestly, that's to be expected. It should work going back in. But let's go ahead and we're gonna do the same thing on the left-hand side. The left-hand side clip is just completely mangled. <laughs> Like who did this? So now that we got those clips out, there's two more here nuts that are 10 mil that we're gonna have to remove. This is on the far left and far right of the bumper, right by the tire, the tire's right here. So just here are those two, that's 10 mil. We're gonna go ahead, take out our 10 mil and we are gonna put that in and we're just gonna remove this screw. Make sure we're on lefty loosey. And again, these are a bit rusted. That's okay. There you go. So we're gonna do this for this side and the other side. And maybe we'll also clean this up just a little bit. The last 10 mils that we have to remove are at the top. So we just removed here at the bottom, those two tens on each side. There's one more here. You're gonna have to pull the felt liner out just a bit. And if you come in a little bit closer, I'm gonna show you that the 10 mil is actually right over here. So you'll be able to see it. You just open up the felt liner a little bit. You'll see the 10 mil. We're gonna go in there and go ahead and remove it. Okay, so it's a little bit tight, but once you're in, you can crack it. Careful for your rim so you don't damage it. All right, so this is loose. It's out, got it, there you go. We're gonna do the same thing on the other side and the main parts of the bumper have been removed. So we have all the bolts removed. Now the tricky part is getting the tabs off of them. You may feel like, depending on the sounds that are gonna happen, you were gonna